Hello everyone, I'm here for a video on my Arsenal podcast show. Regular, before I start all across North America, South America, especially Europe, Africa, Asia, Middle East, Oceania, Caribbean, subscribe if you know, shout out the video, push the notifications, and give it a good like. Let's start. Okay, so Arsenal. So the after the English Premier League ended since a, uh, a month ago, and they're in second place on the table. That means that Arsenal is officially in the UFA Champions League. For the first time since 2017. And that's like how many years is that now? That's like 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17. Seven years. It's been seven years since Arsenal was in the UFA Champions League. The last time I watched the UFA Champions League when Arsenal was in it. They got thrashed around by uh, Bayern Munich, one of the teams from uh, the Bundesliga in Germany. First time in seven years, Arsenal is in the UFA Champions League, and they're not sure what group they're going to be in. Going to be Group A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Depends. I hope they only go on the group, uh, group D because in the football terms in Europe, if you're in Group D, you're, you're in the group of death. Group of death because in that group, there's really good football teams in Europe. Like Shakhtar Dunsnik of Ukraine. You got... Uh, Gal- Galatasaray, you got like uh, Manchester United, Chelsea FC, of course Arsenal FC, you got of course our rivals Liverpool, Tottenham, Hotspur, and uh, I'm not sure about Sheffield, Sheffield United, and uh, Borussia Dortmund, another great Bundesliga German team. Bayern Leverkusen, by Bayern Munich, Real Madrid, Barcelona, Real Real Sociedad, and Ajax, and other great football teams in the UFA Champions League. Let's see if, if Arsenal actually do really good this August between the UFA Champions League and the English Premier League. You know, like back and forth on those fixtures. The UFA Champions League is every Tuesday and Thursday. The English, the English, uh, the English Premier League is every Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. And rarely. If it's like in pictures on Tuesday, Wednesday, those are the rare ones. So, yeah, that's the whole entire appeal of Arsenal's second place advance to the EFA Champions League for this coming fall in September. Now for the, the playoffs of it, they get in. Well, Arsenal's already in already. They started, they started in September. But the other teams will have to qualify to get in to the UFA Champions League. Get in to have a chance to win their title. But for, for Arsenal, they're going to win their... I'm not sure how many times they actually won a UFA Champions League title. I'm not sure when's the last time they won it. But if they do go, go that far right next year in 2024, 
I believe the finals. I believe it should be in the um, the Wembley Stadium in London, England. I, I believe that's the next uh, place for the finals. So that's it for my European content. My final thoughts all across North America, South America, especially Europe, Africa, Asia, Middle East. Oceania, the Caribbeans, subscribe if you're new, share out the video, push the notifications, give it a good old like, live long and prosper, and peace out.